already a drug and weapons free zone, the Rio Hondo School District is now also a balloon free zone. The move came Monday as students in elementary to high school were sent home with notices informing their parents that balloons, whether for parties, birthdays or upcoming Valentine's Day, are prohibited on campus. Superintendent Annalise McMinn tells us administrators and principals made the decision last week following the death of San Benito student, seven-year-old Ruby Ramirez. According to autopsy results, the girl asphyxiated on a balloon. She passed out at school. Jessica Macias, mother of two, agrees with the district's proactive approach. It was a big shock. Uh, obviously, the first thing that came to my mind was my child and the parent, her grief on losing the life of a child at such a young age for something that could have been avoided. McMinn says although Ruby was not a student in her district, the incident shed light on national statistics regarding balloon deaths. She says she'd like to keep her district incident free. I think it's a good thing that the school district is taking action and trying to reduce uh, these type of situations that are occurring. Um, although it can happen anywhere. I think it's good that at least at school it's not going to happen there. McMinn does not believe the restrictions are crossing the line, but rather following common sense safety procedures like restrictions regarding peanut products to protect children that are allergic. San Benito Superintendent Antonio Limon says San Benito isn't banning balloons, but there are new rules in place in lieu of Ruby's death. Only when the teacher is using them uh, as, as a means of instruction, making sure that all of them are, are not given out to students, making sure that we do not use uh, balloons as rewards of any sort.